Now, we added our Lionheart governor, but what if we want to make that the default? So um, we looked in here where we said default is not set, but there's something else we need to change. So if we go to our JS, uh, our include, and then our Linux folders, we're going to find a file called CPU, CPU uh, frequency.h. And if we bring this up in both uh, the stock one and in my uh, custom uh, kernel, we can do some comparisons to see the difference. But essentially, uh, if we had chose the line heart to be the default, it wouldn't actually work. Um, it would have failed back to performance because that's the fallback governor. So if you want the CPU frequency default governor to be something else, uh, we of course would have to say yes in that line, but we would have to add these lines here to give it that option. So in this case, uh, we're doing this for the Lionheart. So we can just transfer these um, over. And it's just saying, if you define that Lionheart to be the default, then external structure, go ahead and define the default governor as the Lionheart. And it's um, giving a, uh, a reference to the, the Lionheart. So if we save that file, and now we go ahead and open up our configuration, arch arm config, in this case, science and mod, def config, and we search for our lion heart again. We find it is not set as the um, default, and the performance is set. So we'll change the performance and the, um, the lion heart to the opposite. So we want the um, make sure not messing this up here. Yeah, okay. We want the uh, CPU frequency default governor performance. We actually want that one to change to is not set. So uh, just like these ones here, um, and we want the Lionheart to say. Yes. So we say this one is not set. We comment it out, and then we say default to be the line heart. Yes. And so if we say that, then uh, we can actually choose the line heart to be our default uh, governor. So um, if we don't make clean, then we're just making the boot image with the, uh, the files that are already been created, and it's just going to build the portions that have changed. We're still going to see a lot of scrolling output as it goes through to uh, build that. But we just run MKA boot image, just like we did before, except we're not doing make clean, so it won't take the full six minutes to build this, hopefully. Let's see, let's go to our out target product and objects, internal objects. Our drivers, and of course we have our CPU frequency and we still see the Lionheart has already been built. Um, this is of course a good way to save time is by not running make clean, but you do always run the risk of if you have some uh, dirty or old material that you've changed that it doesn't realize has changed, you may not um, may not get the expected results. So if the results don't work after running before, oh, there's our CPU frequency has been built. So and it didn't error out or give us a problem. So that's good. So there we go.